Welcome to Vlogmas day 14. I'm like really tired today. I'm trying to think of anything's happened yet. I did a workout, arms, and that's pretty much all I've done today. Beautiful. Good morning. Let's open up all the advent calendars and see what's inside. I'm not gonna have an English muffin today because I'm honestly out of eggs and I like to eat them like together, but not together, you know, as like a meal. Um, so I might order a smoothie, which I probably shouldn't do, but I also have no food, so we'll see. Let's start with this one today. It's the 14th. Okay, should I guess lip gloss again? Let's find out. First of all, this is adorable. This little case it comes in, it's a little tweezer set. Honestly, adorable. Let's do the gnome one next. We're gonna open up day two. Here is today's pattern. I actually really love this pattern. It's very cozy. All right, last but certainly not least, we're gonna open up the jam advent calendar. I don't see number 14 anywhere. Okay, wait, here it is. Let's open it up. All right, here's the reveal. Cherish family and friends. And the flavor is grapefruit dragon fruit spread, which I don't know that I'm gonna like because I don't really like citrus jams like I mentioned, um, but we'll give it a taste. We're gonna try the jam on the rosemary crackers today because I'm not in the mood for an English muffin today. Mostly because I just, like I said, I don't have any eggs to like pair with it. Um, so let's open it up. I don't know that I really like how that smells, but you can find a knife. All right, I made a little bite. I kind of did a lot. It's kind of a nice color. Um, let's taste it. All right, so it's honestly not as citrusy as I expected. It doesn't taste like super unique though, if that makes sense. I feel like a lot of the other flavors have had like pretty like strong flavors from the ones that were at least mentioned on the jar. And I feel like I don't really get a lot of grapefruit and honestly dragon fruit, at least in my experience, isn't that flavorful. So, I mean, it was pretty good. Is it my favorite? No, but much, much better than I expected. Honestly, it's so cute. Okay, but yeah, I'll see you guys later in the vlog. All right, as promised, I'm gonna try the cookies that Ashlyn made me, and I just wanna show you how cute they all look at the package. Um, but I was just getting a little, little plate of cookies for an afternoon treat. Um, but yeah, I'll show you the packaging, so it looks cute too. Like, look, they're so cute. Like, look at the pinwheels. So I guess these are peppermint pinwheels, and these are cocoa, Ginger snaps, ginger sparkles. I feel like it said sparkle, um, but either way, Ashlyn, I'm waiting for your bakery to be open. Sorry, the lighting's kind of weird. We're gonna start out with the ginger snap. Cocoa ginger snap, I think there's chocolate. Did I read that right? Yeah, cocoa. Mmm, they're so soft. And the crunch from the sugar. That's good. I've never had a cocoa ginger cookie before, I don't think, and it's really nice. Let's try the other one. This is adorable. I love sprinkles. Okay. I smell the mint. I love mint. This is stunning. It's actually stunning, and it tastes so good. I love mint, and I love ginger cookies. So thanks, Ashlyn. Hello, it's the afternoon now and I'm done with work. I have a lot of like cleaning up to do, so I'm gonna do that. I might write a few cards. I'm cooking HelloFresh tonight because out of the blue that arrived, so we get to have that. Um, and then I might wrap a couple of Christmas gifts and then I just like wanna watch TV because I was uploading vlogs for like four hours last night and didn't get to like chill. So I really wanna do that tonight. Um, that's pretty much it. Hello, I just wrote a couple Christmas cards and now I'm gonna show you a little haul of some things I got in Arizona at the like street festival that was going on in Tucson, a couple stores that I really like on 4th Street there, and then some crystals, I got some cards to send, I got stickers for my memory book, and I'm just gonna show you everything, except I'm not gonna show you a few gifts just in case they're watching but just know maybe one of you out there is getting a gift from Arizona. I am going to try to tell you where everything's from, 
but we'll see. One of my favorite businesses that I saw at the street fair was Juju and Moxie. Um, the people working there were so nice, so highly recommend. I feel like you can shop online. They gave me this little card, so maybe go online and shop if you're interested in anything I show from them. I'm gonna try really hard to make sure I get it all right. So we'll try to start with that. So I got a bunch of stickers from them. They're all like Zodiac stickers. Um, so I got this Virgo one, a Leo one, a Taurus one, one for myself, for my notebook, a Sagittarius one, a Cancer, another Cancer. And then I just liked this, this little gummy bear sticker. Um, wait, there should be more. I thought there was one more, but it might be, might be hidden away or maybe I didn't buy it. Anyway, those are the stickers I got from Juju and Moxie. I also got this cute postcard. You know who you are if I'm mailing you that. Um, I also got this cute postcard. And then I got two pens. I don't know. They're pretty cute. You are on top of the hot cocoa I got yesterday, so you're kind of sliding. But I got one more thing from there, but I'm not going to show it because I got it as a gift, I think. Unless I keep it for myself. But did I show it? but I got it as a gift. Okay, next up, I got this for myself at the bookstore, which is called, I'll put it on the screen. I always like pronounce it wrong and picture it wrong in my mind, like the spelling. So I got myself a hand towel that I'm gonna hang like on my um, oven because I like doing that and I'm obsessed with Arizona and I was mostly wanting this one because it ha had hot air balloons on it and we were going in a hot air balloon. So you can't even really see the hot air balloon the way it's folded right now. That's all I got, oh wait. I got this card, I'm gonna mail to my grandma from the bookstore. It looks like the artist is Saria Canning. It's pretty cute, hopefully my grandma will like it. And then for my memory book, I just got a little postcard to glue in there. And then we're almost done with all the random stuff. Oh, I also got this at the bookstore for my friend. I don't think she'll be watching. So yeah, I don't know. It has grapes on it and it's just like cute. Like I love keychains, so hopefully she'll like it. There's like little ice cubes and boba in there. Anyway, that was for my friend. And then at the restaurants we went to, I purchased stickers for my memory book. So I got, I couldn't decide because these are both cute. So I got both. And then the sister restaurant where we got ice cream. Like we just love stickers. They're so cute. Okay. We're almost done. Oh no, I'm going to lose you again. The angle just gets to keep changing. So I purchased some crystals. I went with some gifting in mind. Um... So that's how I ended up with all these. I will just, oh wow, I kind of got a lot. So I got this one, it's a butterfly. I love this one. This malachite's so pretty. It's a little heart. Um, this angel aura like marble shape. I feel like very circular shaped crystals are kind of inconvenient, but it caught my eye. And then the, these, I'm not gonna tell you what any of these are called because I feel like a lot of the names of these give away who they're for, but literally stunning. All right, and they were giving out free stickers. So check out Aquamarine Daydream if you're ever in Tucson. Um, and then I couldn't stop there with the crystals because I was on the hunt for a certain crystal and they didn't have it in any of the stores I went to. But the place I went to was having like a holiday deal or something. So I got three Cinnabars because I came to the store to get Cinnabar Quartz, but they didn't have any. So I figured Cinnabar, regular Cinnabar, will do the trick for now. Um, Cinnabar Quartz is like four million times prettier, but you know, gotta do what you gotta do. Okay, let me know what your favorite thing from the haul is. Oh, and of course, I got myself the ornament for my tree. I was just stamping a letter to my grandma on the card I showed you guys. 
and I got to use the stamps my mom sent me for my birthday. They are so cute. They remind me of Thailand. Um, so yeah, you guys should all go get these stamps if they have them at your post office. I don't think I've seen these at mine, so I guess I don't know how she got these, but they're so cute. All right, we're gonna cook HelloFresh now. Um, Connor's actually at a Bulls game tonight, so this is just gonna be for me, and then either Connor or I will eat this for lunch tomorrow, the other half. Um, just because we have three meals and it's already Wednesday, I feel like I have to cook something tonight. Um, and this sounds the best to me right now, so I'm gonna cook it. Probably going to kind of skip some of the instructions just because I genuinely want to sit on the couch and do nothing. If you've never tried HelloFresh, I guess I'd recommend it because I feel like the first few orders are like really inexpensive. Um, we've actually been using HelloFresh since we moved here um, because we got the coupons and then now we just get it every now and then, um, not like consistently or anything. Usually it shows up as a surprise like this did. So yeah, I'm gonna get cooking and then I'm probably gonna watch a YouTube video as you can see, I did not actually make the recipe that they asked me to. I just put everything on the tortillas and made them into tacos. So, yeah, probably cut my time down by literally only five minutes, but I'm ready to hang out. So this is going to be the end of the vlog. Thank you for watching day 14. I will see you all tomorrow.